Mayor Ford, have you smoked crack since being elected? Please, please, I said. Are you going to talk to us, Mayor Ford? At City Hall, media continue to be camped out outside Rob Ford's office demanding an answer to the shocking allegations uh, in the video, which has been now confirmed by Chief Bill Blair. Other councillors are asking, is this becoming of a mayor? Adam, so one of the things we're looking at is uh, that I think is being not talked about enough is the racism and the homophobia that, that's on the tape. Um, so maybe you want to talk to me a little bit about what your thoughts on this are. There's a lot to unpack here. Um, the, the homophobia, the, the, the racism, um, you know, that in of itself are good enough reasons why he shouldn't be mayor. And it, 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 you don't need a, a police investigation to understand it. His, his homophobia has been on the record here at City Hall for years. He was elected despite it. And, and now the scandal is, is front and center. It's, it's being, it's being um, I wouldn't say covered over, but it's being bypassed as, as, as more salacious details become known. He's a very troubled individual. He's a very flawed individual. And it's not a question of, of, of trying to hold him to a higher standard than anybody else. Racism and homophobia are unacceptable in anybody, let alone an elected official, let alone the chief magistrate of a city. Uh, what are your thoughts on, on his alleged comments uh, on the tape? If the tape and the video, we, I could look at that, I think that would answer all these issues. But it's so difficult to comment on something when you haven't seen it. And as difficult as it may be to see, I think we really need to see that. And okay, I don't know if we'll be able to because I don't know if the, the police chief will have the ability to release it because it's in front of the courts, which is frustrating. If the video comes out and you see it and everything turns out to be true, what will, be, what will you say to him? What will be your advice to him? And will you ask him to step down? You know, it, it's going to be very difficult for me to give the, if you want to call the benefit of the doubt, because these are very serious allegations. And, you know, at some point you have to go, what is best for the city. The fact of the matter is that something is fundamentally wrong here in our city with respect to the matters that we've been dealing with as it relates to issues surrounding the mayor. And we ought not to forget that because I think it clearly has an impact on our city. And our job, first and foremost, is to the people of Toronto to reflectively represent their interests and to ensure that the city is actually not put at the butt end of many jokes because we've all worked so hard to ensure that this city has its, its, its place in the world.